Hello you, welcome to Geekism and welcome to another Planet Zoo update. It is International Tiger Day, uh, which means we have a new animal for the pot. Uh, it is the gorgeous Bengal Tiger. I actually called this one, uh, put a tweet up yesterday saying International Tiger Day tomorrow, just saying. And, uh, and yes, they uh, have not failed to deliver on the Bengal Tiger. Uh, really lovely animal. Um, there's about nine different subspecies of tiger they could have picked from, I guess, and that we may well see more, who knows, but they have gone for the Bengal Tiger. Uh, the most um, largest population of tiger currently in the wild uh, it's, it's still nothing they are still incredibly endangered but of all the subspecies of tiger uh, the Indian tiger or the Bengal tiger is the, uh, the most populous one uh, you occasionally see white versions of them. Uh, a lot of people on the social media posts around this one have been saying, oh, I hope we get to see a white one. I personally don't think we will, uh, mainly because it's an incredibly rare phenomenon to have a white tiger, and uh, it's due to the fact that the uh, the colour gene in them being incredibly recessive, so the only way you can really get them, uh, other than you know the one in a million chance, is to, uh, is to inbreed. And with Planet Zoo having uh, such a focus towards conservation and care of animals, I don't imagine uh, inbreeding is going to be something they really want to sort of focus on. So, personally, I doubt we'll see white tigers uh, purely because of how much uh, they have been pushing towards uh, keeping the animals sort of safe and healthy. Uh, other options we could see uh, from the Bengal tiger, the other sort of main big one, I guess, is the Siberian tiger or the Amur tiger. They're the uh, they're the biggest ones, uh, physically largest ones. Uh, they have a slightly paler fur than the other tigers, um, but there isn't really much in it, to be honest. And other options include the South China tiger, uh, the Malayan tiger, and the Indo-Chinese tiger, or sometimes it's known as Corbett's China, which I believe is the, uh, the, the hunter that um, sort of found the subspecies, or, you know, discovered the subspecies uh, but overall really gorgeous creature and um, the video they've showed us is a very brief sort of video of them chilling out a lot of big cats spend a lot of time just sort of hanging out on rocks and stuff which is fine but i'll be really interested to see how these interact with scenery because tigers are known to climb pretty well um so yeah it'd be interesting to see whether we get any sort of uh, correlation uh, from real life into the game with that in in that respect to see whether they actually sort of climb up the trees or whatever uh, I guess we'll find out at a later date but overall really great animal to see come to the game very excited to see them uh, to build some exhibits for them uh, there you go the Bengal tiger really super short video today because it is literally just a couple of minutes uh, a couple of seconds even footage of it uh, just wanted to let you all know in case you weren't sort of scaring the social media feeds of Planet Zoo like I am I know a lot of people just kind of hang around here for their news and let me do the hard work which is perfectly fine by me and I really appreciate uh, the fact that you're all sticking around for it looking forward to the full release of the game later this year thank you so much for watching hope you've enjoyed it if you have you can give us a like it really does help out and if you're not already don't forget to subscribe and uh, thank you to all of our patrons they make these videos possible through their incredible support at patreon.com geekism thanks for watching I'll see you in the next one